Hello everybody, my name is Alex Centeno and I'm with Mercados Interactive Partners and in this video cast I'm going to be showing you how to make Drupal installations in less than three minutes using two of my favorite tools Drush and Fake Browser or Fake um, Automation Browser for Mac. So let's get to it. So the first thing is that I'm going to show you is here I am in the platform or of fake and you can see here that I have a do JavaScript um, action and in this action I have a set of variables that you have to change depending on your project and uh, in well this action is located in this workflow that you can download from Mercals.com I just go to the to the website mercals.com, uh, check the section for video casts, and you will be able to download this workflow uh, to use with with your fake browser. So uh, you need to make the changes here, obviously, uh, and then everything else happens with Drush. So let's go ahead and head to terminal and start with the installation. So the first thing that we're going to do is do download. Drush. Uh, I'm sorry, download Drupal. You don't want to download Drush first. You, you want to make sure that you've you've installed Drush in your computer. Uh, now that it's installed, I'm going to move it. And um, There you go. And now we're going to create the settings.php file. So you can go to my example slash sites default default and copy it to sites default settings.php. Alright, once we have that, then let's jump into my SQL. And let's create a database for the website. Uh, my example. And that's pretty much it. All right. So let's jump back to fake and we're going to run the workflow. So as you can see, uh, what fake is doing is populating all the fields necessary for the installation. Um, and it takes care of all the process without you having to type anything at all. While that's happening, you can also go ahead and download with Drush, the devil module or devel module, devel, enable it, and enable devel generate, and simply give it a command Drush gen C. 15 and it generates as you can see 15 posts so how cool is that in less than three minutes we have a full installation of Drupal and you can do this as many times as you need uh, especially if you're working in a project and you don't want to install certain modules in that project uh, you want to test those modules first then you can just go ahead and create a new installation, test the module, use it, and then if it works the, the, the way that you want it, then go ahead and install it in, in, the, in your testing site for the client. So extremely good, good uh, technique, and I hope that it works for you guys. It definitely works for us. So I appreciate it, and don't forget to visit mercados.com, M-E-R-K-A-D-O-S.com. Have a good day. Bye-bye.